Hello and welcome to this video where we will learn about the functions of a chairman, board of directors, CEO, CFO, MD, CPO, and CTO in a large company. A chairman or chairperson is the leader of the board of directors who presides over the board meetings and sets the agenda for the board's discussions and decisions. The chairman also represents the interests of the shareholders and ensures that the board fulfills its duties and responsibilities. The chairman may or may not be an executive director or the CEO of the company. A board of directors is a group of elected individuals who represent the shareholders and oversee the management of the company. The board has fiduciary duties to act in good faith, with due care and in the best interests of the company. The board appoints, evaluates and compensates the CEO and other senior executives, approves major policies and plans, monitors performance and risks, and ensures compliance with laws and regulations. A CEO or chief executive officer is the top manager of the company who is responsible for the overall success of the business and making the top-level managerial decisions. CEO is the public face of the company and also a link between the board of directors and operational managers. A CEO is elected by the board of directors. A CFO or chief financial officer is the senior manager who oversees the financial activities of the company, such as accounting, budgeting, reporting, auditing and tax planning. The CFO also provides financial analysis and guidance to support the strategic decisions of the CEO and the board of directors. An MD or managing director is a term used in some countries to refer to the CEO or a similar role. In other countries, an MD is a senior executive who is responsible for a specific business unit or division within the company. An MD reports to the CEO or the board of directors and has authority over the operational managers and staff in their area. A chief people officer or CPO is the most senior person in an organization with responsibility for managing its human resources or our. A CPO oversees all aspects of human resource management and industrial relations policies, practices and operations for an organization. A CPO typically reports to the CEO and acts as the architect for the company's talent strategy and corporate culture initiatives. A CTO or Chief Technology Officer is the senior manager who oversees the technological aspects of the company, such as research and development, innovation, product development, engineering and IT systems. The CTO also advises the CEO and the board of directors on the technological trends and opportunities that affect the company's goals and strategies. I hope this video was helpful and informative. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you.